Oh, for fuck's sake. Are Kislev the new Norse or what? <laughs> oh, fucking hell. It's not good about it's uh, chicken, I don't know. What's he got? Big TV advantage. 12 men's, but not a lot of skills, really. Four re-rolls, a guard block. He's probably won every game by, by his uh, yeah, fun factor. Might go with um the fucking terrible guy. No, I should carry the warrior really, shouldn't I? Not the uh... I was thinking of sure hands, but if he doesn't have strip Which he doesn't. Jumpy men jumping your sexton bones. He doesn't have a dodge player. He's got a wrestle player, but not a strip player. Wizard is good though, isn't it? Mm. Two ten for a guy. Could get a just a merc warrior. It's not even that bad, is it? Yeah, all right. Block warrior, wizard, a journeyman. <sighs> Thank you for the bit, uh, Henry Judas. Ah. Uh, Yeah. I mean, could just go for a 300, could just go for Borak. Mighty blowing, but a wizard's good, isn't it? And a block case where he's almost Borak anyway. Right, I'm gonna get some salt. Right, I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna fucking mute myself for a bit while I'm eating dinner, so I'll be right back. Yeah, it's very good, Colonel West. <laughs> I'm definitely not going to do that again. I can't believe he's fucking... After getting banged on by Kislev, I'm going to have to play them again. I mean, if this is a loss, I guess I could restart. Because, yeah, you don't want to constantly restart, but you also don't want to start with a shit record, do you?
<sighs> right, I'm back now. Um, finished my dinner. What what team have you got, Shawnee? Chaos or? <coughs> three tackle. <coughs> yeah, three tackles there. Uh, Yeah, more fucking kids though, unbelievable, isn't it? Hopefully, and, but this guy's got a bit of block, so I wouldn't get so mad if this guy was as successful. I was defended wrong though, because this warrior should have been up there, but bloody moved him twice by accident with a stupid fucking bug where you click on them, but their thing comes up and you don't click. You know, you know what I mean, where you try to click. I'll try to click this guy, but it doesn't click because of the fucking card. No, Destronov, not jealous at all. <coughs> <coughs> I mean, I guess if the two dice, the uh, warrior anyway, it wouldn't have made that much difference. side too soon but it's a two dice block with block isn't it with block with mighty blow <laughs> way better than block maybe I should just hit the guard guy <coughs> Fucking game, man. Holy shit. Why won't it click? You can hear me clicking. Hello. Fucking click. It's, oh, it's such a piece of shit. It does my nothing that you can't just fucking click on your players. Like, holy shit. That's as bad as their fucking setup. Fucking ridiculous bullshit. <coughs> the warrior block got long there, and um, because Sing Soros down loads of TV, um, about three hundred TV down. So got um, a wizard 
and a mercenary Chaos Warrior, because I had a Miss Next Game Warrior. So I thought, you know, three Chaos Warriors isn't very good. So I got the mercenary one, and then had some money in the treasury, so I thought, why not give him block? Because it's pretty good, isn't it, to have a block? A block loner is is probably better than a non-block rookie, you know? <laughs> now the mouse is fine, it's just a shit fucking game, you just can't fucking click on people sometimes. It's fucking bullshit, man. That's that's how you, that's how you fucking move, make fucking things by you know move people by accident and stuff because you think you've clicked on the next guy because you have fucking clicked on him, but it just doesn't register because it's fucking garbage. Like stuff like that, sign I should have got right. Like it's fair enough that the matchmaking shit and the champs had is shit and you know all the changes they made were shit. All of that's fine. You can forgive them that, but you know. The, the saved games should fucking... The saved setup should fucking save. And when you click on players, you should select them. And when you click on a square to push somebody, you should push them to that square. Like, they're really fucking bad things with the game. Really bad things wrong with the game, aren't they? Wow, he, he failed a thing. I mean, he's got five re-rolls, but... Yeah, I think all of that is fine, to be honest, because... You know... <laughs> yeah, the fucking defensive setups. Like you, you, you can forgive them not making good defensive setups, but let me fucking save them for fuck's sake. Oh man, TD file. Can't believe they changed that house rule. I had the nerve to say it was fixing a bug. Undead. No, Halflings isn't very good to be honest because um, you don't have block, so you can't even get them. And Pro Elves with a bad coach are pretty good. Skaven with a bad coach. Um, humans. Breaths. Kisler. I mean, Kiz Lever brought the best matchup you can get, to be fair. Not if they don't fail anything, obviously, but like last game. He seems a pretty, uh, pretty decent coach, though, at least. I really don't want to force myself down. Oh, he's giving me this guy to uh, blitz. All right, fair enough. Then. I just want to armor break so I can stick my uh, strength guys in contact and push forward. I mean, I would like to get over halfway at some point, but it's tough to just give away a leap in it. I mean, with two three pluses, he's got two dice. Oh no, he doesn't. He's got a strength four. Alright, I could go forward then, eh?
next turn. I can try to get forward like a mad bastard. Forgot I got a strength four guy. Yeah, but then you'd leave had to leave that guy standing up, wouldn't you? Which is uh, which is dangerous. So I hope you. Yeah, fair enough. Try that is fair enough. And it's something that new players would want as well. So yeah, yeah. The 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 set the the setups the default setups is really terrible. Yeah, to be fair, the, the default setups is terrible. I take that back. That is terrible, the defensive setups. And the offensive setups are pretty bad. But yeah, they should have just had the two setups in it the Rule of Five setup, the Chevron. That's it. Just have every team those two fucking things by default. And even have like a tooltip for beginners, like, you know. This stops your opponent fucking going down the sideline. Uh, you know, two players are safe. And then even highlight them. You know, you could do it in tutorial. A tutorial could have those two fucking safe formations and you could go... You know, because, I mean, obviously it's too late. But uh, even then, even now, they could just put in the two fucking... The two standard ones for everyone, yeah. You know, they, they could and should do that. Now, I don't need to bother too much then. I was scared about him getting too nice on the ball with his guard guy, but I don't need to care so much now. <laughs> yeah, fast diamond. Right, next turn I've got to fucking jam forward as much as possible, haven't I? No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to try. But then he stuns, he stunned anyway, made me. I mean, I've got to make a serious ground, haven't I? If I want to score, but it's looking like the objective is going to be not to score, but to uh, hopefully just not get scored on. I mean, I overcommitted, so it's not that good a defence. It's more of a shit offence. Because I went forward and then stopped. I went, f I committed fully to a side and then stopped. So it's more like a completely fucking inept offence, really. Because I've forgotten how to play against somebody who's competent. Which is 
Which is not good, is it? This is why I don't like fucking playing Champs Ladder, you know? I've forgotten what it's like to play Blood Bowl. I'm going to base everyone and hope it goes all right. Peace, peace, peace. Ball has to go what here. Went backwards instead of going forward. Now I've really got to go forward next turn. It's just terrible, isn't it? It's absolutely terrible just playing garbage. Not even tilted, just playing shit. Maybe that's why I lost before I well drew. <sighs> Some team lost though, didn't they? I think. Oh yeah, the Necro lost. Probably just played shit at all day. Finally got an arm break anyway on turn five. That's what I wanted to try to, you know, make some progress. So at least it finally happened, I guess. And he blitzed the decoy octopus, so that's good.
There's always going to go there. There's still a hole though, isn't there? Um, blitz, block this guy, blitz this guy, and there's a hole. So there's a way through in the end. No, oh, fuck, he's got blocked. Say there's a way through. Pretty bad not pounding. Could just stay there. Well, now he's blocked him going ahead of him. That's good. Chain all sorts of go too far forward. I'm gonna block and get guard in there, can't you? No load, what a fucking shit turn. I'm at the bare minimum in. No, I'm not fucking not even three in. So it's a GFI with a ball carrier. At least I'm not gonna. He's not gonna score at the moment, but you'll probably want to get him into a scoring position now, won't he? Seems it looks like he's gonna get the chance. I'm just down with dumps of beans of shit. I thought I'd get better by playing a lot of blood ball, but I've just got worse. Getting out armor broken isn't even unlikely, just one mighty blow each. Should have pushed hard forward harder. He's only got one health, hasn't he?
time roll a million dice. This one has to be fur. Jesus fucking Christ. Can you imagine if I knocked somebody over? One, two, three, four, five. GFI next turn. Dodge him out. Move him there, him there. One, two, three, four, five, six. He can get round there, so he could go here. He could dodge out. Okay, just roll a million dice. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, he can go there at the end. Oh, he's got a diamond tackle. Well, aren't I a fucking genius? Oh, well, fuck this game, then, eh? Well, one game too many. Well, I say that five games too many, four games too many, or many I play. I don't know, maybe I should just quit streaming and do something productive. I can't even play Blood Bowl anymore. Oh, GMK forever. <laughs> You've come at a good time. Crazy playing someone who plays well, isn't it? This is like the only, uh, the only person apart from Shawnee that I've played who's any good in fucking months. In fucking months. And it's not, it's not helpful for playing good blood ball, is it?
I mean, I was 300 TV down, to be fair. So you shouldn't expect to win with Chaos, but, you know, third game Chaos, yeah, he gets the bounce out. Yeah, close. Yeah, just pass everyone. He blitzes. Gets in the end zone. He goes one, two, three, four, five, six. GFI, GFI. Probably passes it to know, him. Then goes one, two, three, four, five, six. I don't even know how that works. So he can't do it, he's got to dodge in the end zone. He's got to blitz him and follow. And then he goes one, two, three, four, five, six, GFI, GFI handoff. So it's possible. To so start with this. Good. Got the great fucking push. Every block's a push. Probably did that for no reason. Oh, I could have thrown it directly. I threw it to the wrong guy. Oh, well, he intercepted anyway. Threw it the wrong fucking guy. Threw it the guy who moved. I'm just fucking done. I'm just going to mute myself. I'm done. Alright, I, I won't. I guess I won't concede, but. I don't know. Should I just concede? I don't know. I guess it's not seven, right? So. I'll just. Uh, I'll carry on, but I'm done. This is actually just so much worse than getting diced by a shitter. Because in this game, I'm the shitter. Because I don't know what to do against somebody who knows how to play Blood Bowl. <laughs> I literally, I've only played Shawnee. Shawnee's the only person in the last... I know since the last time I played Inarian, how many is that? When, when was the last time I played Inarian in the uh, semi-final? About six months or something, five months, something like that. Five months, the only good player I played. Well, not even good, competent. The only competent player I played in five months. And I just don't even know what to do, apart from Shawnee, those friendlies.
Not using my lightning bolt gun or what? I have to use a lightning bolt and not be one down in my own fucking drive. I mean, it's a good it's a good pro tips video of how not to play. But I'm just disappointed. I'm really depressed at just how I don't know how to play. Don't know how to play football anymore. She only kicked my ass the last two times we played as well. I just can't play blood ball anymore. Lost it. Lost it by just playing people who don't play blood ball continuously for months. My record over the last week has been horrific. Horrific. I'd say I need a week off, but I've already had fucking two weeks off. I guess that is what playing champs are does to you. I could stream fumble for a month, couldn't I? <laughs> That'd go down well. <laughs> It's just not me, 30 bob face, that's the thing. He just hasn't lost it like I've lost it. He's just stayed good. <laughs> and I guess Ducky and Mole and... Inara and everyone else stay good and I've just fucking lost it. Lost the fucking plot. Completely. Need for an insult like that, Andy Devo. <laughs> Still fine. How dare you? I've never been fine. <laughs> Exactly, Dr. Mamabosco. Exactly. Don't fucking come into my stream and say I'm still fine. Wow. Disgusting. There's no need for those kind of insults. Fucking fine. Holy shit. Next I'll be fucking playing for fun. Fuck it, I just play like a shit head eh? Why not?
I might just have to focus on playing the bow for a week or two. That's what I might have to do. Just completely ignore the chat. <laughs> die trying. Get better at Blood Bowl or die trying, yeah. That's what I need to do. There's no excuse for playing like this. I've just literally forgotten how to play Blood Bowl. That's true, Will King. That's true. That's true. To be fair, that's true. That's true. Do you know, does anyone know what the fucking Kislev failing a leap animation looks like? Because I fucking don't. Give away a block, get fucking failing. <laughs> See what I mean? <laughs> Next week we'll be there and have fun. Holy shit. It's hard, it's just hard when I'm ill, you know, that's the thing. That's the thing that makes it so hard. When I feel okay, physically, it's alright. But uh, when I feel like this, I just want to fuck it off, you know. Like yesterday when I tried to get, play a game of cross out, I just couldn't even play one fucking game. Yeah, and stress makes it worse, so it's funny. Not good. I haven't mentally given up. I mean, I know I can still turn them over and win 1-0. Obviously, I mean, I haven't, I haven't given up at all. Yes! There is chaos in the fake breaths. I have to donate today, tomorrow, and broke. <laughs> Thank you very much, uh, Morgan's TV. Thank you very much for the five year. You're a lovely fella.
<laughs> it's so much backwards. Nein, ich habe es <laughs> Simeon never existed. Corn may come out later. He's got to go quite far if he wants to break through here. Yeah, Morgan's is nothing like Gomez backwards. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty funny. Because it's a fumble thing. Um, Corn and Corn and Bretonians have been out on on like you know Blood Bowl two. But they've never been part of like the actual Blood Bowl game. And uh, Simeons have just been a thing in like some divisions on Fumble and they're not even close to being official. So they will they will never come out on Cyanide. Um, or anywhere else for that matter. Imagine if he fails a block here. That'll be fucking something special. Just Corn. Corn well, Corn and Chaos packed, but they're not gonna bring out packed. But they might they might do, uh, actually I don't know why I said that. Um yeah, packed and corn and but corn have been in the game since the start, the uh, icons for corn. So presumably and there's been Zinch and Slanesh have both been mentioned. So presumably they'll they'll bring out they'll make a fucking Slanesh team and a Zinch team. But even if they don't, Corn and Pact might come out at the end. I think I could have maybe served him. It'd been hard though.
Holy shit, an armor break. <laughs> bestie goals. There's no bestie goals, Ducky. There's goals and minotaurs. So you could have bestie goals, couldn't you? They're beastmen runners, in fact. So you could just add more positionals in, in 2016. But yeah, you could have best of goals, couldn't you? You'd have best of goals. That would be the big thing. The big thing for a Beastman team. Ungoals and best of goals you could add. Centre goal would be too many, I think. But at least Ungoals and best of goals. Centre goals, I don't know. Bit fucking stupid. It was a pretty nice turn that to be fair, got some pals, got the armor break. No, it's just a just a beast man. They're literally called beast man ducky. <laughs> in Blood Bowl 2 they're beast men, and in Blood Bowl 2016 they're beast man runners. That's it. No, I'd want less teams GMK forever. <laughs> well, I mean, I guess you could have, like, you could cross packed with Chaos and then have, like, Chaos, you know, Marauders and Chaos Warriors on the same team and then have a Beastman team, but, like, why? <laughs> Problem's gonna be, like, winning it, isn't it? Getting a nil nil isn't is looking possible right now but the problem with chance ladder is trying to fucking win the game Look at this guy, Agility 3 never fucking failing. <sighs> Alright, this is pretty good. <laughs> How many players do I need to fucking commit to this? Only two more. Alright, let's go. Obviously I'm powering. Well, that was okay then. It would have been funny to surf his blitzer though, wouldn't it? It was pretty possible. Just needed a push there. Then come round to here. Put two guys in there. And then surf him. That would have been, that would have been ace to have surfed his... Uh, his shithead. All men's is pretty valid now, I think.
with these two knockdowns potentially and that removal. And that puts more pressure on to maybe maybe go up myself, doesn't it? Our centre goals will look pathetic compared to Bulls. Bulls should be strength five, really. I think is the best to go would be pretty similar to a centre goal stat wise, so it would be a bit. Don't fail the dice roll, whatever you do. Really loving to fail a dice roll right now. He's got to think out. Oh, he's going to score, hasn't he, as well? He had, uh, he had four re-rolls but then got one from the kickoff result and hasn't failed anything. Falls, falls, you know, something that people do. I also think centre goals are fucking stupid anyway. I don't like that they exist, yeah, he didn't fit anything, I was not. 
course not. Just roll all the dice. Knock down these two. They're the movement seven guys. He's going to be stranded and not really be able to do anything. But I do want a safety. So maybe it's worth just blitzing this guy, basing him. Put the strength guy in there. Blitz him into there, and then into another block if it fails. One, two, three, four, five. <sighs> Dice in this. The last two games have been. Just fucking ridiculous. Now he bases the guy, blitters him down. It's just, what can I do? What can I do? Good, fuck you, you random GFO. Holy shit, he failed something. Oh, got a cast from it. No, oh, kill my guy. Kill Best Fagor when he failed something. Right. Safe moves first. Just don't have a canoring threat. I'd like to block him and get him as a canoring threat.
I guess that's what I have to do. Oh my fucking god. These dice have been just fucking awful. Really. The problem is, best to go is Aunt Agility 2, so... You know, I think just part of certain block, they're like bleat, they're just like... Beastman Blitzers, aren't they? So they could just be 6 3, three eight block horns. Oh, he failed something. Holy shit. After my god knows how many fucking bought downs and double skulls. And found that GFI. For the host Kurgo, VIP Kurgo. Alright, the leap to handoffs fair fair enough moving, that's pretty good. Holy shit. Wait, you're telling me there's a chance. One, two, three, four, five, six. GFI pass. One, two, three, four, five, GFI handoff. Alright. Wish I had a fucking reroll for this, eh? Blocked with the wrong guy, maybe. One, two, three, four, five, GFI. Maybe I blocked with the wrong guy. Already fucked it up, because so I'm just done. But never mind. because it made the throw longer. Of course. <sighs> it couldn't have ended any other way, could it? It could not have ended any other way than failing the last dice roll. I've never felt so bad about losing three, 300 TV down. Obviously the Merc gets the MVP. 36 blocks. Let's have a look. One double skull. Both down. 
both down. Double skull, double skull, both down, both down. Four both downs, three double skulls. Four both downs, four both downs, and three double skulls. From 36 blocks. Fuck off. I do feel like I played shit though. <laughs> First half. I think second half I played alright. To be fair. <sighs> you knew it was going to be. He played, he played well, Sfaho. I'm surprised in the rookie league he played very well. First half. It did feel like that, didn't it? it did feel like a lot of pushes. Can have another check of that as well. Almost, almost perfect, but yeah, very, very rarely powers. But yeah, push. <laughs> well, he had block to be fair. Two pushes there, a few pushes. I mean, you you should get about half pushes, shouldn't you? But yeah. There were a lot of turns with just pushes and blitzes with pushes. Then they picked up towards the end on all this. <laughs> this is just the end of the players. But they did pick up towards the end anyway. It was nearly the same as last game. I mean, that is... That is... That was crazy. It was pretty much the same, yeah, but with a different scoreline. Fucking Kislev. Fucking... Some crazy games. To roll that many fucking double skulls and, and both downs. You know, I mean... That's just, that's just really unlucky. It's it's not just because it's chaos. That is just, that is definitely, that's not playing bad, or even playing fine. That's just for being really fucking unlucky, isn't it? But anyway, um, I don't know. I guess I can keep them. It's one two lost one, isn't it? Which isn't the end of the world. I'll I'll just keep going and. You know, try try to play and try to get a better attitude than today. But it was it was just tough. It's just tough when I'm ill. That's the that's the problem. I'm down already, and it's harder to like look on the bright side and stuff and just think of it as a, you know, think of it as a thing that I'm doing, streaming it for you guys. It's just it, instead I just think fuck's sake I'm losing and it pisses me off. But um. Anyway, right, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.